Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something. Oh, it's no secret the Aretino boy is doing some ritual a trying to call the Dark Brother. Come around. Who's going Don't to stop be it? so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from Solitude. Only the, the foolish or the courageous approach a Yarl without sight. Do I know you? Is that so? Ah, uh, yes. You were with us at Helgen. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. Rayloff's alive. I hope that's true. He's a damn good man. But he hasn't returned yet. So I'll need to wait for his account. For now, speak with Galmar. I'm always looking for able fighters. Not everyone can say they made it out of Helgen. Seems we're all branded villains these days. So long as your criminal past stays in the past, and you fight for me with honor and integrity, we'll welcome you into our ranks. And what would you have me do? If he's not with us, he's against us. He knows that. They all know that. How long are you going to wait? You think I need to send Balgraf a stronger message? If by message you mean shoving a sword through his gullet, Taking his city and leaving him in disgrace would make a more powerful statement, don't you think? So we're ready to start this war in earnest, then? Soon. I still say you should take them all out like you did dead King Torig. Torig was merely a message to the other Jarls. Whoever we replace them with will need the support of our armies. We're ready when you are. Things hinge on Whiterun. If we can take the city without bloodshed, all the better. But if not... The people are behind you. Many, I fear, still need convincing. Then let them die with their false kings. We've been soldiers a long time. We know the price of freedom. But people are still weighing things in their hearts. What's left of Skyrim to wager? They have families to think of. How many of their sons and daughters follow your banner? We are their families. Well put, friend. Tell me, Galmar, why do you fight for me? I'd follow you into the depths of oblivion. You know that. Yes, but... Mm. Why? Helgen, eh? Dolphur me. told us quite what? the story. If you made it through all that, you're likely worth something to me. Ah, but first, tell me, why is a cat want to fight for Skyrim. Uh, can't fault anyone for that. As long as you hate the Empire as much as I do, that I can work with. All right. But before I can put you to use, I need to know how much you can take. I have a little test for you. That's what I like to hear. So long as you can back up those words with steel. I'm sending you to Serpent Stone Island. If you survive, you pass. If you die, well, you weren't going to be much use to me anyway. It's where men have tested their metal for ages. It's a strange rock formation built by the ancients. Something about that place attracts the ice wraiths. You kill an ice wraith out there, and I'll have all the proof I need about you. We'll see about that, won't we? I'll die before elves dictate the fates of men. Are we not one in this? I fight. God might get nervous. A woman approaches with a weapon.
get why we're wasting time and dwindling resources chasing a legend. We don't even know it exists. The Jarls are upset. They don't all support you. You're alive. I owe Ulfric a drink. I have to admit, I didn't think we'd be seeing you again. I misjudged you. You're definitely Stormcloak material. It's time we made this official. You ready to take the oath? Before you're one of us, you must swear fealty to Jarl Ulfric Stormcloak, future High King of Skyrim. You must also pledge unswerving loyalty to your fellow Stormcloaks, to Skyrim, and to her people. That's the spirit. By swearing this oath, you become one of us, a heroine of the people, a true daughter of Skyrim. A storm cloak. Repeat after me. I do swear my blood and honor to the service of Ulfric Stormcloak. Jarl of Windhelm and true High King of Skyrim. As Talos is my witness, may this oath bind me to death and beyond. Even to my lord, as to my fellow brothers and sisters in arms. All hail the Stormcloaks, the true sons and daughters of Skyrim. Now you're one of us, which means you get to tag along on a little trip with me. Oh, and here. You're a Stormcloak now. You ought to look the part.